We just got to the lake. It's 344. This is a new jig that I've been tying. It's kind of a prototype. The good one's going to have a painted head, look all pretty. But it's got a sickle hook. And I used to be really, I mean, I didn't throw a lot of sickle hooks until I learned this trick right here. And if you take that sickle hook, with a pair of pliers and you kind of bend it out just a tick and get it past that eye I'm telling you when they get it and you get them they're not coming off still some occasions that I like a round bend as well but with casting you can't beat it and we do a lot of casting where I'm from instead of uh, dropping on them with a long rod so let's start this thing I'm gonna be looking around I'm videoing on my graph as well so we can get some good footage of everything and our goal is to it's 344 right now our goal is to no it's 345 catch 15 fish in 15 minutes and let's see if we can do that we're gonna cast an Ozark Pro Series rod company spinning rod um, 10 footer. I love this little rod for casting my jigs that I tie. Let's see if we can do it. We got a little group of fish here. Um, not the biggest fish in the world, but for what we're trying to accomplish, I think, I think we're going to be alright here. First cast. And we got it all on video. That's one. They got to get in the boat. Nice little white crappie. One. This is a 16th ounce jig that I tied. I like a 16th, you know, anywhere. It all, you can fish a 16th from 10 foot to 20 foot. So I really like the rate of fall. A big key that I've seen with crappy is rate of fall, you know, when you're casting. They like a they like a good presentation. They like presentation is key. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm trying to catch one. We'll get into the presentation eventually. Here comes one. I'm telling you, when they get that sickle, they do not miss it. I love this rod, Ozark. You did a fine job with this one. You can launch those little jigs a long ways. Got some vicious, vicious monofilament panfish, I think is what it's called. You just can't beat the. That's number two, by the way. I do not like not catching one on every cast. It's a true fisherman. <laughs> it's crazy how good the crappy can actually see a bait. Number three, hopefully. Oh yeah. Nice black one. We got whites and blacks mixed in here. Black and crappy. White and black crappy. Number three. 348. We got a little. We're going to have to catch two pretty quick. He's done seen it. There he is. That'll work. Number four. You can see these fish coming up. So 
sometimes, you know, there'll be one off to the side like this. And they're usually a little better. They're by themselves. I like the ones. Oh, yeah. That was actually two together is why it looks so much better. We got to do something here real quick. Everybody likes a little drama though. That's five and we're two minutes behind. This is when you really need it. Need a heavier head trying to fish faster. It's all right. We can get this one. A six. A white one. Three fifty-two. Oh, I need you to make it. Cast short on these fish. It's hard to get them to see it. present it the correct way. Uh -oh. Seven. Come on now, girls. Racing against the clock. Uh-oh, it's a little better one. I'm gonna try to boat flip them. Oh, yeah. Eight. Good one. We gotta get back on schedule. We need one more if we can get this one in. Nine. Oh yes, he fell in the boat. It's hard to try to boat flip a big ones. Oh no. Gotta get one more to get on schedule. There's one. We're back on schedule, but we can't let up. It's number 10. Throwing them back. Five more, guys. We got five, a little less than five minutes. Oh no. Oh, he come off. It's going to cost us right there. I like how you can shake this Ozark rod too. 11. These are pretty black crappy. I'm 
trying not to get too close. Oh gosh, we got exactly three minutes to catch three more. Oh, oh no, he popped off. Being stingy today. They're hitting it so hard, what happens is they push it. 13. They push it out of the way and it's really just turned sideways in their mouth. And so when that happens, you're pulling on them and it just pulls the hook right out of their mouth. So you kind of just gotta, oh, that's a better one. Number 14. Oh, I'm getting worried about boat flipping these better ones. We got less than two minutes to catch one more. Come on, guys. Hang with me. One more. Here he comes. He's on there. Oh, smallest one of the day. We're gonna try to get another one. We still show in two more minutes. That's 15 though in 15 minutes. Ozark rod, I love them. Let's see if we can get them up out of here. Here comes another one. He got it. Good one. Oh, a good white one. 16. We got one minute. And there's a better one there. Here he comes. There he is, and it's the best one of the day. Look at that. 17 fish come on let's try one more we're still showing 359 take it away from him all right, guys, 17 fish in 15 minutes. I hope y'all enjoyed that. We'll try to do a video with, you know, going after some bigger fish. But I love catching crappie. I grew up doing it. I literally spend a lot of time in my off season dialing in the unit, the Garmin for bass, but it's hard for me to pass up crappy even when I am bass in a bass tournament. Um, I want to shout out that Ozark Rod Company. I'm not sponsored anything like that by them, but this little, the exact number on it is CS100 2ULS Pro Series. Um, it's a 10 foot spinning rod, two piece. I'm telling you, it will cast a jig a long ways um i got a 3000 size reel on there which i love because you can put a lot of line and it'll it'll come off the reel super easy um y'all have any questions let me know like this video please um comment and we'll catch you on the next one see you